Excited about your next big launch or need to take your site offline for maintenance? Well, in today's video, we are going to cover not one, but two versatile pre-designed templates that will make your job easier. The first one is a modern coming soon template with a countdown timer to build anticipation for your upcoming launch. And the second one is a maintenance mode template that will keep your visitors informed and engaged when your site is temporarily down. So without any further ado, let's dive in and let me show you how to make use of these templates. The templates we are going to use in this project is offered by W Design Kit. Speaking in terms of figures, it includes over 2000 pre-designed templates and 100 plus pre-built widgets for Elementor, Gutenberg and Bricks, along with a cloud workspace and much more. We are going to discuss about more of its features in detail soon, so make sure you watch this video till the very end. Now, let's make sure everything in the WordPress backend is set up for the smooth operations of this project. So. Starting off from the WordPress dashboard, let's quickly move to the plugin section and make sure you have installed Elementor. We'll also be needing W Design Kit, so come up here and click on Add New Plugin. Then search for it, and here it is W Design Kit. Simply click on Install Now, then Activate. Moving on to the appearance, you will notice that I'm using Nexter theme. It's one of the lightest Elementor theme out there, perfect for great performance and security. Though it's only my personal recommendation, so you can definitely choose any other theme that fits your needs. Now, in order to use this plugin, we'll need to make an account with W Design Kit. So simply come here and click on W Design Kit. Next, up here in the header section, click on Login. At the bottom here, it's written Don't have an account. Click Sign Up. Here, as visible, you can sign up with your socials, or here, after you fill all the details mentioned, simply click on this button. I already have an account so I'll click sign in and then we'll click on continue with Google. Once you're logged in, you will get to see this kind of interface. Now there is no need to search for anything as the template we are gonna import for today's project are here only that are the coming soon and maintenance mode. A point to be mentioned that we've got these kits for both that are Elementor and Gutenberg page builders and I'm gonna cover both the segments in this video only. First, let's understand how can we import and make use of them in Elementor. For that, I'm gonna go ahead and simply click on this download button. After you do that, you'll find yourself inside the kit. Here you can decide whether you wanna import the whole kit consisting of 17 templates or choose the ones you like. So let's scroll down and check out the whole kit. You can see how professional all the design looks. If you are a design freak, it's definitely a treasure trove for you. That too for free. I like this one, so I'll mark it check, then scroll up and click on download. Lastly, it's asking me to download one more plugin that is the plus add-ons for Elementor. So I'll do what it says, next, and then click on import. Now we have to follow the same process for maintenance mode template kit. On opening it, we've got 15 templates here in total. Mm, I'm gonna choose this one, then download. Our templates are now successfully imported. You will find them by moving to pages and here they are. Our coming soon and maintenance mode templates. It's time for the truth, whether we can customize them according to our liking or not. Let's check it out by clicking on edit with Elementor. Cool, here we are inside the Elementor editor. And as you can see, I'm able to select each and every element that of course are widgets used within this design. Look how their customization options are getting visible in the side panel. This means I can edit everything, whether it's the header, the countdown or the social icons. Let me quickly make a few edits here to give you a sense of confidence. That's done. Let's now edit the maintenance mode template as well. For that, revert to the WP dashboard. Then click on pages. Here let's find our maintenance mode template which we just imported a few minutes ago. Then lastly click on edit with Elementor and shabam, it's open. 
Just a quick reminder that this template is designed specifically for websites that need to temporarily go offline. For example, if your site needs maintenance or updates, this template will keep your visitors informed and engaged during that downtime. Now let's not waste any more time and quickly edit few of this template elements as well. Very cool! So that's how you can import and edit the templates. Everything is fully customizable, giving you complete control to make it your own using the Elementor page builder. But wait, I told you that I will also demonstrate the import and editing process for Gutenberg as well. Open the WordPress backend and here let me tell you that in order to make use of these templates, we need to download two necessary plugins that are the plus blocks for block editor and Nexter Pro extension. Remember that Nexter has a theme and a plugin as well. That too we have to install its pro version. So make sure you visit nexterwp.com, check the pricing and choose the one that satisfies your professional needs. Once you do that, come back to the backend, upload the Pro Nexter plugins file. It's done. Also, we don't need the Elementor plugins anymore. So let's quickly remove them so that they don't cause confusion. Next, from the side panel, click W Design Kit. And now we are gonna import the templates from the Gutenberg kit. Simply click it open. Here, scroll down and select the template you like and click on download. Now open this drop down and select Nexter Builder. Lastly, click on Import. Moving ahead, apply the same process on the Maintenance Mode template as well. That's it! Once the template importing is done, move to the side panel and click on Next Up Builder. And here, as you can see, we've got both our templates here. If you want to edit them, simply click on Edit. The Gutenberg editor will open up and now, as noticeable, I'm able to select each and every element and making changes in them flawlessly. Pretty cool, right? Once your templates are finalized and ready, let me show you how to enable the coming soon and maintenance mode and make these templates basically live for your users. Well, to do that, it's pretty simple. Just follow along step by step. Hover on appearance in the side panel and click on customize. Then click general. Next, here at the bottom, you will find maintenance mode. Just open it and turn on this toggle button. After that, you will get all the necessary settings. Simply choose your mode from here. We'll keep this setting logged in only. And next, we're gonna select the template. Here, let's assume that you want a little break for your website or it's under maintenance. So let's select the maintenance template. Once all these settings are confirmed, click publish. Now here on dashboard, you can see the site is officially under maintenance. Let's see how it's visible to the site visitors by opening this live site in a private window. Perfect! It is showing exactly the way I wanted it to show. Before we wrap up, now that you've seen how easy it is to use these templates, don't forget to explore the rest. The two templates we just explored in today's video were just one of many pre-built designs available out there. Whether you're launching a product, announcing an event or just temporarily going offline, there's a template here for every occasion. They're all designed to look highly professional and save you a lot of time. All I will say is that just allocate some time and take your pick and make your WordPress site stand out with minimal efforts. And that's a wrap on today's tutorial. Now if you're curious about the differences between the coming soon and the maintenance mode templates, I've got you covered. Check out the blog link in the description below for a deeper dive. Now don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel with the bell icon turned on so that you don't miss any of such amazing videos we keep on adding inside our W Design Kit playlist every week. Until then, stay creative and keep learning.